we know that a conditional sentence is a sentence that gives a condition and the outcome of that condition. It expresses that the action in the main clause can only take place if the condition mentioned in the conditional clause is fulfilled. Now let us read this sentence. If you heat ice, it melts. Now this sentence is a conditional sentence where if you heat ice is the condition and it melts is the result. So if you heat ice is the conditional clause and it melts is the main clause. Now this conditional sentence expresses a fact or a general truth that means every time you heat ice it melts. So this conditional sentence talks about a real life situation where if the condition is fulfilled the result is certain. So the result will always happen if the condition is fulfilled. Now these kind of conditional sentences are known as zero conditionals. Now the zero conditional sentence has the conditional clause in the simple present tense and the main clause also in the simple present tense. So what are zero conditionals? Zero conditionals are sentences which express a fact or a general truth where the result is certain if the condition is fulfilled. They talk about real or possible situations. Let us look at a few more examples. If I go on a boat, I feel sick. What does it mean? That every time I go on a boat, I feel sick. So this sentence is a zero conditional sentence where if I go on a boat is the conditional clause. I feel sick is the main clause. And you can see that both the conditional clause and the main clause are in the simple present tense. If you don't have the right password, you cannot access the website. Now this sentence is also a zero conditional sentence. So this sentence expresses a fact. So if you don't have the right password is the condition. You cannot access the website is the result which will always happen if the condition is fulfilled. Hence, if you don't have the right password, is the conditional clause. You cannot access the website, is the main clause. And both the clauses are in the simple present tense. Now that you know what a zero conditional sentence is, let us do this exercise. Identify the zero conditional sentence. Now we have two sentences given to us. If you touch a hot pan, you will get hurt. If you touch a hot pan, you get hurt. Now both these sentences are conditional sentences and both these sentences express the same meaning. But which sentence is a zero conditional sentence? Let us see. The first sentence, if you touch a hot pan, you will get hurt. Now we have learned that the zero conditional sentence has both the conditional clause and the main clause in the simple present tense. Now you will see here that if you touch a hot pan, the conditional clause is in the simple present tense, but you will get hurt. The main clause is not in simple present tense. So this sentence is not a zero conditional. Now let us look at the second sentence. If you touch a hot pan, you get hurt. Now in this sentence, the conditional clause, if you touch a hot pan, is in the simple present tense. So is the main clause, you get hurt. So this sentence, if you touch a hot pan, you get hurt, is the sentence which is a zero conditional. Now let us do another exercise. Fill in the blanks with the appropriate form of verbs given in the brackets to form zero conditional sentence. If you dash the key, the robot dash talking. The verbs given to us are press, 
and start. Now we know that both the clauses in the zero conditional sentence have to be in the simple present tense. So if you press the key, the robot starts talking. We know that starts is the singular verb form in the present tense of the verb start. So we have if you press the key, the robot starts talking. So what did we learn today? Today we have learned about the zero conditional sentences. So zero conditionals express a fact or a general truth where the result is certain if the condition is fulfilled. They talk about real or possible situations. Zero conditionals have the conditional clause in the simple present tense and the main clause in the simple present tense also. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You can also register for free at deltastep.com or download the Delta Step app to get all learning resources as per ICSC, CBSC, IB, Cambridge or any other curriculum. Over 5000 amazing lectures across maths, science, English and social science. Our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our iDictionary feature allows you to quickly revise any concept. Master each topic at your own pace with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions. Get instant answers and detailed solutions. Be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests, performance analysis with actionable feedback, personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubts. That's not all. You can also win amazing prizes like PlayStation, iPad, watches and many more along with certificates through our Earn As You Learn program. So learning at Delta Step is not just fun and easy, it is also rewarding. So register for free now.